Hey YouTube, this is uh, King Cobra JFS with another video. Um, took a shower, and then I got out of the shower. I got all my uh, dishes done. They're sitting in their kitchen drying. And uh, after, before I got the dishes done, though, I vacuumed the entire carpet, and then I went and attacked the dishes, and then got them drying and all that. And then I took a um, my my uh, kitchen mop and um, some. Uh, kaboom grease remover and a little bit of um, dish soap and some hot water and uh, got the kitchen floor all mopped up looking shiny again so sweet the uh, reason being is I, I have an inspection in, in a couple days here and I don't want to fail it by any means I actually like living in, on my own for the first time you know what I'm saying it's quite nice especially with Stephanie coming in a couple of days you know what I'm saying like I don't want to be like calling her and shit and saying, yeah, honey, you know, I didn't pass the inspection, but I'm pretty confident I'll pass the inspection. The carpet looks pretty good. Um, when we were shampooing it, there was some stuff, there was some stuff we weren't able to get, unfortunately, but um, for the most part, the carpet's vacuumed up, looks good, nice and clean, you know what I'm saying, so, yeah. Now my hands are all soapy from, you know, we're soapy from. Oh, this is turning shit. Um, now it's just a matter of waiting for the kitchen floor to dry after mopping it. Once it's dry, I'll put the mop back and all that. But, um, yeah. I don't know how long it'll take to dry. But um, the important thing is, is that it dries and you know, all that. And I realized there was a lot of sticky stuff on the floor from when I was cooking stuff. So, they had to get taken care of like that. So, yeah. The last thing I gotta do before the inspection is um, my bathroom floor it needs it badly, but I'll hold off on that for a second. There was some paint in the sink um, from when I was washing my hands after making wands, and you know it got all over the inside of the sink. That was an issue that was addressed. I got that taken care of. Um, the bottom of the bathtub was kind of disgusting. To mince words. Um, we got that taken care of too, and the toilet was gross and all that, yeah, so, just keeping her cleaned up and all that, you know. Like right now, if you were to turn on the kitchen light, the floor would be really shiny, because I just, just mopped, so. thing of it is, if I get kicked out of my apartment, that's not going to happen, though, because I'm pretty confident that, you know, I'll do a good job and keep this place cleaned up and stuff, so, yeah. But if it does, my dad's all like, yeah, you're going to come live with, me, live with me in North Dakota, and I'm like, you know what? I'll jump off a church bell tower before I fucking do that shit. Hopefully it kills me, too. I don't want to kill myself and I don't want to lose my dad, so I think the best option here is to keep my apartment clean. And it's been keeping up nice and steady there. And yeah, it looks good, so sweet. A kaboom works for like tough grease stains and or whatever, you know, just cleaning chemical I bought at the store. I like it anyway. It works wonders. A little bit of that, some, you know, dish soap, some hot water, and, you know, it's makeshift mop water basically. <laughs> um, fill the sink up with hot water and put a little bit of each in there and kind of like all sudsy and mix up and then. Do like four coats on it. First three coats are soapy, less soapy, less soapy, less soapy, and then eventually just to dry mop and you know, mopping it up and stuff. So, yeah. I got the uh, mop leaning at the edge of the kitchen there, so 
I could just put it back right now, but not while the floor's still wet. I don't want to leave footprints on the wet floor. Fuck that. <laughs> I got a couple more services that need cleaned off yet, but um, those aren't going to be too hard to clean off. I don't um, clean it like every day, like once in, once a week. I'll get down in there and you know do a little each day, you know, keep it up and stuff. Here's the mop I'm using. It's one of these kinds of mops. Full handle right here, squeeze it, you push it forward, and that basically squeezes the brush. That's how it rings itself out. So yeah, that's how I keep my uh, keep my pad clean. Yeah. Unfortunately, the vacuum decided to quit working, or as I got done vacuuming the entire carpet. Minor inconvenience, but oh well. I'm sure it's fixable or replaceable. <sighs> Still got some of that nail polish I had off from Halloween. I would have it removed right now, but um, like I said, I don't have any uh, nail polish remover, so. Just letting it come off on its own course, I guess. And wearing gloves at work until it's completely off. So I'm pretty confident I'll pass my inspection. You know, there were some issues that were addressed last time when my apartment was last inspected. Those issues have been taken care of and then some. So I'm making a huge effort here to keep the apartment clean because the uh, last thing I want to do is lose it. You know what I'm saying? Um, and I hate the fact that my dad's like that. You know what I'm saying? That he immediately says, you know, it doesn't look at all options. It's just, you know, I don't want to move back into my dad's with my dad or anything like that and I don't you know what I'm saying I like having my own space it's nice <laughs> it'll be even sweeter when Stephanie gets here so but uh yeah for the most part it's just keeping it clean and uh you know and it's, it's looking pretty good it's you know keeping up the stuff so yeah um, got this white tub right here next to me. It's got some cigarette ash on. I can use cleaned up next. So, put all my wands on my um, computer desk here. And, um, get that surface wiped off next. still wet then I ain't gonna go into the kitchen to grab what I need because I keep all my cleaning chemicals on a shelf in the kitchen so I'll have the floor still wet I'll have to wait till it's done drying before I continue my um day-to-day -day stuff here I should keep all this day-to-day -day and it won't get so freaking bad but yeah so I get all my wands off the shelf here all right so that's next right there in my computer.
not trying to be emo about the whole situation here. I'm just saying. Um, I don't want to move back into my dad. I just don't. Uh, there's times we'll get along and everything's cool, but then it just takes one of us to say something the other one doesn't like, and right, we're at each other's throats, and you know. So honestly, I don't. You know, what I'm saying that's not something. It's just like, yeah, no. My girlfriend's coming to live with me, and the last thing I want to do is end up living with my dad because I get kicked out of my apartment. Fuck that shit. Fuck that shit. Um, so yeah, I'll um, wait till the mop and mop floor is done drying, and then I continue with it. Um, should probably throw a shirt on. <laughs> Skull and crossbone pajamas, that's what's up. Anyway, this is uh, King Cobra JFS with another video, and um, thanks for watching, and I'll see y'all later.